Well, hello, boys, girls, and gifted animals. How are you today, tonight, this morning, whenever you choose to view this? I'm doing well, a little bit hot under the collar, and I'll explain why. Now, I wanted to do a... Oh, Lord, there's a car pulling up right next to me. It looks kind of awkward. But, um, I don't know. I always feel awkward when I'm talking to something or... or you know, that, that people can't see, and then people think I'm, um, you know, just like talking to myself or something similar. Regardless, I'm a little bit hot under the collar because um, I wanted to do a Krispy Kreme review, and I, I looked up on my, my Google Maps, and apparently they're permanently closed. Permanently closed. So I drove out there, uh, and uh, aghast, I was, um, I was just... I couldn't, I couldn't believe that Krispy Kreme closed within this winter. I mean, it's been a harsh winter, don't get me wrong, but to close a business that was opened last time I checked um, just seems wrong and, and unfair and unjust. And the closest other one is in Milwaukee, which is a little bit drive, a little bit of a drive. So, I don't know. So today I did Dunkin' Donuts. I mean, that's the only other thing I could think of. And uh, I know it's disappointing, but I'm going to review a glazed donut. One thing I really wanted to do at Krispy Kreme is get a hot, fresh glazed donut. There's nothing better in the world. It, like, melts in your mouth. It's delicious. It's terrible for you, but it's good. And I haven't had their coffee ever, so I wanted to try their coffee. I'm a big fan of Dunkin' Donuts coffee. I'll go ahead and tell you right now, it's smoother than Starbucks. Maybe the caffeine content in it isn't as high, but it's just a smoother, better coffee, in my opinion. I get it with a little bit of cream and Splenda. A little bit of cream and Splenda. Wait, Carl liked it. So anyway, I got a glazed donut. Now they didn't, inc this came to 273 for this small coffee, which I imagine would be a little bit bigger, but it wasn't, uh, which is fine. Um, and then this glazed donut, this is exactly how they bagged it. Like they, they put a glazed donut, not even any wrapping, they just put a glazed donut in a bag. That's awful. Let's taste it anyway, see if it's fresh. You know, I mean, I have no napkins. This is going to get my fingers all sticky. If you forget to pack napkins in a, just with a donut, I mean, you're really missing something because donuts are messy. You know, I can see it, you know, even though it really, really, really is, um, you know, a pain to not get napkins anywhere you go. This is especially just an inconvenience and um, might get all over my um, two dollar shirt and um, my 50 cent tie I mean it's a good donut man I really want to do Krispy Kreme permanently closed I even drove over there just to see. Lo and behold, it was closed. See, I can't get that off. Donut's pretty good for two seventy three for a small coffee and a donut. Is it worth it? Nah, maybe. And donut has absolutely no nutritional value. It literally is a fried piece of dough with icing on it. So it couldn't be worse for you. Are they delicious though? Yes. It's a little bit dry. I mean, again, Krispy Kreme is flat out the best when it comes to donuts. I might go to a gas station because they sell Krispy Kreme sometime. I think 7-Eleven does. Maybe I'm wrong. I have to check. I know some of these gas stations do. Just have to peek around a little bit. Let's go ahead and finish this off.
I mean, it's unremarkable as a donut. I mean, is it a decent price? Maybe. And I don't know what the going rate for donuts is right now, but it's okay. Coffee's phenomenal. I do love their coffee. Um, the guy who gave it to me, I think, forgot to put the Splenda in because it just tastes like it has cream. It's fine, but I like my coffee a little bit sweeter. You know? I don't think there's anything in here except for cream. I'll deal with it, though. It'll do the trick. <sighs> After all this disappointment, I'm going to try to find a Krispy Kreme donut. I really was looking forward to their coffee, though. I just haven't had it. Maybe some other items on their menu. Maybe bagel, I think they had on their website, at least. So, Dunkin' Donuts, their coffee gets close to an 8. I would say that... Um, it's just a really good smooth coffee. It, it's nothing uh, overpowering. It's just it's a good coffee. It's got a good flavor. Uh, it's robust yet smooth. And I'm going to rate that a 7.631. The donut, on the other hand, there's nothing spectacular about it. It's, it doesn't even match up to a fresh, hot, crispy cream. So the donut... I mean, gets a 5.004. Anyway, hope you're doing well. God bless. We'll see you again. You take care.